Addressing Climate Change with Holistic Living Models. One Community Weekly Progress Update, number 420. One Community is a 501c3 nonprofit organization. We are creating open source and free shared blueprints and resources, tools and tutorials, and do-it-yourself instructions for highest good living. Creating solution models that create additional solution-creating models in the service of all life on this planet. My name is Jay Sable, and I'm the Executive Director of the One Community 501c3 nonprofit organization. One Community is bringing together people with the consciousness and the desire for the highest good of all life on this planet to build sustainable and self-replicating teacher demonstration hubs as a pathway to global sustainability. And today's topic, well, this is our, our April 11th, 2021 uh, episode of our weekly progress updates. And today's topic is addressing climate change with holistic living models. And uh, this is a topic that's dear to my heart because climate change is something that I'm seriously concerned about for my children and my grandchildren uh, to come and uh, for the world that we live in, this one planet that we share. And so uh, a lot of people are concerned right now because it doesn't seem that governments are taking enough action, that world leaders are taking this seriously enough, that the planet is taking decisive action fast enough. And whether or not you agree or disagree with that doesn't really matter. My personal belief is that the more solutions that are implemented, the better. And so one community is a holistic living model designed to address climate change, not directly. I mean, it does address it directly, and that's not the specific uh, sole intent of one community. It's one of many, many goals of one community. And so the way that we look at it as addressing climate change with holistic living models is to create radically sustainable living models built on radical sustainability, on comprehensive sustainability that covers all the foundations of sustainability, food, energy, and housing, but also sustainable and highest good approaches to fulfilled living practices, education, economic models, and then putting that under the umbrella of true earth stewardship, like teaching people how to be earth stewards and why that would benefit them to actively steward their environment and to live a regenerative lifestyle, not only for themselves personally, but for the ecosystem surrounding them, for their communities as well. And so this idea of addressing climate change with holistic living models is to create living models that provide a way of living that most people will consider to be far superior to the way that they're living right now that is made possible through sustainable infrastructure and sustainable living practices that also address climate change. And so this is why I say that, oh, we don't need to say that one community is about addressing climate change. It's by the very nature of living sustainably addresses climate change. And then there's this much bigger vision of, of one community, this much bigger goal of one community, that if we can make this easy enough, affordable enough, and demonstrate one community models and sustainability models like this as attractive enough, the ideas will spread on their own. And we're creating one community as a teacher demonstration hub designed to teach others how to create teacher demonstration hubs also. So everything that you see happening in the background of the video here are the sustainable village models and so much more, the food, the energy, the housing, education, all this stuff put together. And it's designed to be a solution model that when combined in one place is a solution model to teach other people how to create their own solution models a self-replicating solution model. You know, the idea of, you know, teach a man to fish instead of give a man a fish and that, you know, natural disasters are on the rise and, you know, global challenges with housing and energy infrastructure and food and education, social injustice, inequality, all of these things are on the rise. And rather than trying to put a band-aid on the solution, why don't we create a solution? It's, uh, sorry, a band-aid on the problem. Why don't we create a solution to the problem and teach people how to implement that? You know, rather than just providing food aid and delivering food, let's use permaculture principles that can regreen the desert and rejuvenate destroyed lands and make them abundant again. And let's build sustainable communities that house the people that are doing this work so that we can create permanent housing and teach them how to teach other people how to create permanent housing out of sustainable resources that are readily available to them, like the earth beneath our feet. These are the ideas and building homes that can last hundreds of years, not 50 years, not 100 years, 500 years. This is our idea, you know, and so this is what we're working to do and to create one community as the first holistic living model that puts it all together, that takes the food, the energy, the housing, 
as well as what we call the highest good approaches to education, fulfilled living, uh, economic models, as well as a true stewardship as an evolution of sustainability combined to create this living experience that is better than the way most people are living right now and show them that experience, invite people to participate. Come and experience what one community is. So when people step onto the property and they see the quality of the food that people are eating, they see the quality of the life that they're living and the access that they have to the things that they want and the time that they have to do the things that they want. Everything is within walking distance and the carbon footprint isn't just zero, it's negative because we're processing you know, the waste and the plastic and the garbage that comes onto the property from other people that are visiting as well and recycling that effectively and efficiently. And we have tutorials for all of that and clear explanations for how we're gonna do that demonstrating not just a net zero carbon footprint, but a net negative carbon footprint. Eating food that's not sprayed with poison, drinking clean water and breathing clean air, you know, and enjoying and sharing the entire environment. The whole social and recreational architecture that's built into the infrastructure of one community that is modeled off the idea of a club med or a cruise ship where everything that people want to do or could imagine that they would want to do is within walking distance a vacation type environment that is run and operated and managed by everybody that lives there as a lifestyle. The enriching and enjoyable lifestyle being one of the greatest commodities that we can share and experiences that we're sharing to infect people with the idea that this way of living is possible. And once people understand that, it will be very difficult, we believe, to go back to the way that they're living before without wanting to return to this. And then providing all the tools, the tutorials, and do-it-yourself resources for replicating all aspects of that so people can create the complete environment and live a completely new way of life, a totally holistic living model, or just take the individual components. Maybe build a sustainable house. Maybe grow a garden that they've never grown. You know, maybe implement a, a recycling model or uh, or a home education model that they've never considered before. All created from our perspective to the best of our ability with the highest good of all life on this planet in mind so that when other people take those ideas and build off of them and implement them and adapt them and modify them and hopefully improve them, it's an even bigger step in the right direction. Trying to provide something for everybody. So this is what one community is up to. This is how we're creating uh, or how we're addressing climate change with holistic living models and so much more than just climate change, social injustice and inequality, you know, obviously sustainable housing, lack of energy infrastructure, you know, education, all of these different things, you know, food insecurity, global food insecurity. And, um, you know, the greatest challenges of our generation and generations to come can be addressed with a model like this. And we are here to demonstrate how that is and we're creating all the open source plans to implement it and and replicate it globally. So this is what one community is up to. Stick around for a couple more minutes if you like bullet points on all the major components of our project. This is our written blog if you'd like to see details on everything that our uh, all volunteer team has accomplished within the last week and with links to all the open source content that we're creating, uh, it's all on our website. And um, yeah, thanks for watching to the end. And of course, until next week, we will keep on keeping on. Thank you. The one community approach to highest good housing is eco-artistic home building that is affordable, sustainable, do-it-yourself duplicable, resource and space efficient, and consists of seven different sustainably constructed village models. One community is also creating an open source duplicable city center. It is designed to be LEED Platinum certified, provide 12 guest rooms, dining for over 150 people, and laundry and recreation space for over 300 people, all while saving money, time, space, and resources. One community's approach to highest good food is duplicable almost anywhere, scalable for different needs, more biodiverse and nutritious, part of forwarding a global open source botanical garden collaborative and includes nine different free shared and duplicable growing environments. The next component is highest good education. This component is complete and pretty much ready to launch once we're on the property. One community's approach to highest good education is designed for all age groups, adaptable to any schooling environment, inspiring and fun for all participants, includes national standards, all subjects, lesson plans, teaching strategies, learning strategies and tools, classroom design, and more. The one community approach to highest good society is globally focused, individually enriching, cooperative and collaborative, includes a highest good network and application, 
four different economic models and combines fulfilled living and true earth stewardship for the benefit of all people and all life on this planet.